Hey guys, it's Lindsay. Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be doing my everyday makeup routine. Me and Anna did this video a while ago, but my routine has kind of changed a little bit, so we thought I would redo it for you guys. But this is just my everyday makeup routine. I didn't really wear much makeup to school, but now this is like my summer everyday makeup routine. But yeah, let's get started. So I'm the type of girl who just likes to keep it simple with my makeup. I'm just gonna lay everything out. I don't like it to look like I have makeup on. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna start off is my L'Oreal Infallible Pro Glow. It's a concealer in the shade five, sand beige. And I'm just gonna put this on any problem areas I have on my face, like any pimples and stuff. But I am going to tie my hair back. And I'm going to be looking right here because that's where my mirror is. Chasing all the other men wet. And then I'm just going to be using my dry beauty blender because I'm too lazy to go get it wet and just blending that in. I don't know how much longer I can use <laughs> these two like face products I have though because in the summer I get pretty tan. I can get a lot tanner than I am right now so I might have to go buy some more and this might turn out and this might even turn into my concealer, which is crazy because oh, I, I used really light colors. But I'm pretty sure on spring break I used that as my concealer when I did wear makeup, which is absolutely mind-blowing. Why is that red thing? Hold on. <laughs> Alright, and then I'm going in with my Maybelline New York concealer in tw shade 20 sand. And I'm just going to put that under my eyes. And then with my dry beauty blender, just blending it in. For school and stuff, like I probably just would wear mascara, but I just feel like concealer. Like I don't know if you can tell, but like this eye versus this eye, like you can see like right here, and like right here, there's like darkness. And blend, 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 blend. Next, I am. I am going to go in with this, which is Blush Serum, and it's from the brand Beautying Beauty. I got it in one of my Ipsy packages, and it's a liquid. I'm just gonna squeeze it a little bit till I get some on my finger. I'm gonna stab some here, here, and then I do a little bit on my nose, because I think it looks really pretty. Okay, it looks like a lot on camera, but I swear it's not that bright. And now I'll go on to the hard products. But I'm just gonna go in with my mini Hula Benefit bronzer in, does it say the shades in here? Okay, well I'm going in with this one. It's not the darkest and it's not the latest. And I'm just using this Real Techniques brush. If there's a step I'm gonna skip, it's gonna be this step. Like, if I don't have enough time, it would definitely be this step because it's definitely a not needed step for me. But for the sake of this video, I'm going to do it. Then I'm going to take my Becca, my Becca highlighter, and I just hit pan. Do you see that? That's so sad. And this is in the shade Champagne Pop and literally my all-time favorite highlighter. Did you see that? Beautiful. I literally use this probably like three, four times a week when I actually do makeup. And every time I'm just like, you're kidding me. Whatever extra, I just put it on the tip of my nose and then put it on my nose and I'm gonna run a little, little bit right here. And then face is done. All right, and then now let's move on to eyebrows. Now I fill my eyebrows in with eyeshadow. Don't judge me, it works fine. And I always get complimented on my eyebrows. I just brush through my eyebrows and now I'm going to go in with my James Charles X Morphe palette. I'm going to be taking the shade Benny, which is right here, this dark one, and barely getting it on my brush. And then lightly putting it in my eyebrow because my hair is starting to lighten up now, so I don't want my eyebrows to be too dark. Wow, that looks so dark. Does that look really dark on camera? Yeah, that looks really dark. Why does everything look so much brighter on camera and darker? That's that eyebrow. Now I'm going to do the other, so done. I should have demonstrated with this eyebrow because this eyebrow is always my good eyebrow. Does anyone else have a good and bad eyebrow? Because I certainly do. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're almost done. I'm not gonna do this, but I'll just tell you what I normally do. So sometimes I will take the Hula bronzer and the Becca highlight, and I'll just put the Hula bronzer in my crease and this on my lid. And then, yeah, and I get compliments on that too. I'm not gonna do that this time, but I am gonna take the Becca highlight and just put some on my inner corner of my eye, because I think that makes a big difference. Just makes your eye look brighter. 
I don't know if you can see on camera, but my eyes just pops a little bit more. And now it's going to be moving on to the last step, which is mascara. And I just got this new mascara in my Ipsy package, and it is by Benefit, and it's the Bad Girl Bang Mascara. It's in the mini size. And I think I like it. It's still like new, so it's still like pretty chunky and like heavy. All right, I just finished my mascara, but I'm gonna show you guys a little trick that I do. Oh, hey, look who it is. Hi. All right, so this is a little trick that I do when I'm impatient and need my mascara to dry. <laughs> Boom, there, my eyelashes are done. And my last step is to go in with my Steve Lauren little clear lip gloss. Just makes my lips spark a little bit. But yeah, and that is my finished everyday summer makeup routine. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. I love how this look turned out. And this is what I would do every single day. The comment of the video is gonna be right here. Thank you so much for commenting and make sure everyone go like and subscribe and comment if you would like a shout out just like that one. I hope you guys all have an amazing, wonderful day. Happy summer. Bye guys. If you saw how you were balanced right now. <laughs> oh, dang it. Whoa. Which is a book. Did you hear that? All good. And it, it's a nap. Hey, feeling good. Like I should. When in Durkle, walk around the neighborhood.